One of the best things you can do for your body before a flight is to stretch. This all levels flow will open your body up before a long flight ahead, even a short flight. You don't need any props. A mat is helpful, but if you don't have one and you're in a hotel room, that's just as fine too. So we'll come to all fours, tabletop position, shoulders are over the wrists, hips over the knees. Take a back bend, dropping the belly, drawing the shoulder blades together, and then reverse that exhale, press through the palms around the spine. Cat cow, so here, inhale deeply, look forward or up. Exhale, press, rounding the spine. Again, inhale, back bending, and exhale, rounding the spine. Inhale deeply. And exhale, pressing the palms, rounding. Any movement here, inhale. Exhale, round. Inhaling. And then moving hips, look over to the right side, over to the left, like a puppy chasing its tail, look to the right, and over to the left. Come back to a neutral spine position, extend your left leg out behind you, right arm out in front. Exhale, draw elbow to the knee. Inhale, extend back out. Again, exhale, draw it in. Open. Exhaling. Inhale, open. Exhale, connecting elbow to knee. Inhale. And exhale, draw it in. Inhale, reach long. Lower the right hand down. Left knee draws into the chest. Step the left foot between the hands. We're in a low lunge. Reach the arms up overhead. Let the hips drop towards the mat. Lift up through the chest, finding a back bend. Keep breathing, and then bend the right elbow, grab hold of it with your left hand. Nice stretch, draw your head to the back of the elbow crease, and still in a back bend, stretching your tricep, side of the wings, hands lower back down towards the mat. You're going to bring that left leg back behind you, tabletop position. Inhale, back bending, back to those cat cows, exhale, rounding. Switching sides, left arm extends out in front, right leg out behind. Draw it in on the exhale. Inhale, extend out wide. Exhale, draw it in. Inhale, open. Exhale, draw it in. Open, inhale. Exhale, in. Exhaling, draw it in. Inhale, reach long. Left hand lowers down. Right knee draws into the chest, round the spine. Step that right foot between the hands, low lunge. Arms extend up overhead, reaching long through the fingertips. Nice opening for the front left hip here. And then just like on the other side, you're going to bend the left elbow, grab hold of it with the right hand. Hands lower down to the mat. Step the left foot up to meet the right. Inhale, long spine. And exhale, forward fold. Bent knees, interlace the hands, small the back, and let the arms drop forward up overhead. Relaxing the neck, again bend in the knees, feel the weight shift from the soles of your feet, left and right, front to back. Maybe a little wiggle side to side, opening up the shoulders. Slowly roll your way all the way up to standing, inhale, arms up overhead. Grab that left wrist, lift up and over to the right side, side bending. Switch sides, side bending to the left. Inhale back to center. And exhale, forward fold, bend those knees. Step the left foot back. You're gonna to turn to the longage of the mat. So toes in, heels out. Bend the right knee, now working the inner hips. Left leg stays straight. Keep a long spine. Switch sides, bend the left knee. Now the right leg stays straight. Breathing. And turn to the back of the mat. Right knee is bent, extended side angle. Right hand grounds inside the foot, left arm extending up overhead, right in front. Breathe deeply here. Shoulder blades draw together, heart stays open. And as you lower the left hand down, twisting. Shoulder blades draw together, left leg stays straight. Just open to the right. Right hand lowers down to the mat. 
and you simply switch sides. Extended side angle, left knee is bent. Right arm extends high, we're out in front of you. You have a long line of energy from the outer edge of your right foot all the way out through the right fingertips. Right hand lowers down towards the mat. Twisting, right hand down, left arm spinning up high. Wrist stacking over shoulders, shoulder stacking over wrist. And lower the left hand down towards the mat. Set the right foot outside the right hand and lowering into Malasana prayer squat. So the heels don't have to lower down here, as I always say. Keep the spine long, lifting up to the chest. Move a little left, move a little right, side to side. Eventually lower all the way down towards the butt. Arms out in front and ease your way down towards the mat. Grounding, lower the feet to the mat, coming into a bridge pose as you lift the hips up Wiggle shoulder blades under, shoulders under, side to side. Maybe interlace the hands. Press the chest up and back, up and back, and breathing. The back of the head grounds down to the mat. Maybe you stay here or you prop up to wheel pose, hands behind the shoulders, fingertips facing in towards you. In either one of these variations, chest is pressing back behind you, opening up. And eventually ease your spine all the way back down towards the mat. Give those knees a nice squeeze into your chest. Rock a little left and right, making circles. And with the arms out in a T position, twisting right, drop the knees to the right side. And over to the left side. Remember to breathe here. Coming into pigeon, reclining pigeon. Right ankle over your left knee. Keep the back of your head, shoulders connected to the mat. Right foot flex. And breathe. Simply switching sides. Now the left ankle crosses over the right knee. Left foot is flexed. Breathe, relax into the mat. Do your best, keep breathing. Soften the face. the knees into your chest, rock your way up to seated position. Coming into boat pose, Navasana. Lift up to the chest, yes you can do this. Press and charge through the balls of the feet. Knees are bent, 90 degrees or parallel to the floor. And then hug the knees into your chest, lower the feet down. You're coming into cross-legged position. Find a gentle seated position, side bend. Right hand comes down, reach the left arm up overhead, weave it out in front of you. Left arm extends on up, flow with your breath, right hand down, inhale, left arm up. And drape the left arm out in front of you, right arm up. Come on back up to center, twist to the right. And then take it over to the left. Coming back to center, neck rolls, drop your right ear, right side. Left to your left side. Get out any last kinks in the neck. Try and keep your shoulders down away from the ears. And eventually coming back up to center and neutral. Take a deep breath in. And a long breath out. Time to fly, warriors. One of the best things you can do before flying is stretch. Before, after your flight, self-care is important. It's part of your wellness journey. My name is Sarah, Live Free Warrior. See you next time in another city around the world.